God's awesome song. Carrie, I love this lyric. and um, Thank you. Um, it's just beautiful. And so much depth mm -hmm. and theology in this song. Mm -hmm. Talk about this. I know you wrote this with some friends. And mm -hmm. um, uh, it really is kind of a modern hymn in some mm -hmm. ways, but just with a contemporary yeah. um, treatment to it. But talk about this and just the inspiration behind the song. Yeah. Um, 
really just wanted to talk about what our calling is and and just take away like all the things we experience in life and questions we have of God and you know really pales in comparison to the reason we're on this earth and uh, we're going to go through difficult things but the cause of Christ is what we're what we're to be about and the Lord says to to go out into all the world and to to preach the gospel the good news of the cross and and so like what does that really mean for us that means taking up our cross and sometimes it means not fully understanding why we're going through certain things but at the end of the day um, one of the things that kind of inspired this song was just saying to the guys hey I want to write something about um I might not ever fully understand the why of certain pain and certain experiences we have, but I want Jesus more than I want to understand. So for this cause, I'll live. For this cause, I die. I surrender everything. And there's joy found in, in Christ. And I think my favorite verse of the whole song is the one that says, It is not fame that I desire or stature in my brother's eye, but I pray it said about my life that I lived, bo- I lived more to build your name than mine. Mm. And I think if we would all take that stance in our lives, uh, it just would, it brings glory to God. And um, it is all about worshiping the Lord and bringing fame to the glory in the name of Jesus. Yeah. I remember when we first heard this song, you know, we're, it's a bunch of music guys sitting in a room, you know, (laughs) thinking, oh, this is a really great song. And it gets to that last line. And I think we all look like we've been punched in the gut, you know, because it's just such a, it's such an honest, challenging statement. And Mm -hmm. I think for anybody, you know, whether you're leading in church, whether you're on the platform or whether you're just a business person or a mom, whatever, it's, that's the real challenge in life, isn't it? Is to be like, God, no matter what, you have the glory and not myself. Yeah. And mm-hmm. I just remember when we first yeah. heard that, it was like, everybody just kind of looked at each other and was like, oh, man. Yeah, I couldn't, <laughs> I couldn't wait to play this one for my dad. He's a godly man and, and the theology of it and everything. And I just sat there and stared at him, you know, while he's listening. And then I see him just start to tear up at the very end. And he just got so moved. And it made us all kind of tear up. Mm-hmm. And um, I just thought... You know, it's just sweet to be reminded of that for all of us. We're going to go through difficult stuff. The Lord never promised us that we wouldn't, but he did promise us that he's with us. And and then to just be reminded that at the end of the day, it is about the cross. He does give us the grace and the strength to walk through this life. And it is for the cause of Christ that we're that we are to live and, and make him famous. And um, yeah, just I'm excited for the church to, to learn mm. this song. I am too. And Cody, if you'll kind of show us what you're playing there, just to, to set the, the frame here, you're tuned to Half Step Down, mm-hmm. Capo 3. So we're in, we're in the key of A, mm-hmm. but you're playing G positions. Right. If you get all that straight. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> key of A, G positions. Right. Um, so it's, it's really simple. Um, uh, it's in 3-4, which is a bit different. It's a bit unique. Most songs are in 4-4. Four, four. So there's a bit of a 3-1. So the verse is just that, uh, the G shape, the D, the D shape, the A minor shape, E minor, and then at the very end of the verse, it takes the A minor and it walks it up to the C, right before the chorus, and the chorus starts there, to the G, E minor, D, and then it hits the one over three there right before that. It's kind of like a little kick that hits for that little passing chord. And then it finishes out the same way. So. Yeah, and then the bridge starts on the, the six? The, the two, the A minor okay. here. Two. So the, the six, E minor, to the one, the G shape, five. And it's just that the whole way through. Two, six, one, five. Yeah, well, guys, thanks so much for coming yeah. by and sharing it with us. This is a really beautiful song. Thank you.